This week's autopsy asks what killed Janis Joplin, the biggest female rock star of the 60s. The official verdict was that she died of a drug overdose, but in my experience, it's never that simple. But show host Dr. Michael Hunter has a lead. In the coroner's report, I can see that they found a number of prescription pills used to treat insomnia as well as anxiety. One of the things that Janice did throughout her life was to, to self-medicate, to escape from difficult feelings. Real says Janice's signature escape was a bottle of Southern comfort. Every day, she gets so out of it on booze, she has no memory whatsoever of the shows that she's played. And alcohol wasn't the only drug Janice was using. It's clear that Janice was fighting a serious addiction to heroin. I think Janice transitioned into heroin sometime in 1967. Between 1968 and the end of 1969, she overdosed on heroin on six occasions. Autopsy says Janice battled her addiction before she died. I need to find out if this abuse led to her death.